Well, we certainly have come a very long way since this. Got milk? <laughs> oh, boo yourselves! I'm Garrett Bobby Ferguson. So now, we've got a new Garfield movie coming out, directed by Mark Dindle, who's made an official comeback in animation after a 20-year hiatus. He's known for Cats Don't Dance, and the absolute comedic classic that is The Emperor's New Groove. However, he also made Chicken Little, which he didn't have much creative control over the movie. And even though it's called the worst Disney movie, I consider it a guilty pleasure. I ended up watching this with my mum, and I say it was solid. The animation is colourful, and the slapstick is animated really well. The story is simple but solid, and the main characters like Garfield, Odie, and John work really well in their roles. And the new characters are serviceable at best. I also love the soundtrack and the voice acting. With the voice acting, while well, some of the actors did a nice job, some only did a good, but not great, performance. First off, there's Chris Pratt as Garfield. As much as he tried with Mario by giving him a Brooklyn accent, he wasn't much of a good fit for Garfield, mostly because Chris Pratt's mostly known for being a positive character. If I were the casting director for the movie, I'd pick Ryan Reynolds since he's great at doing sarcasm in the characters he's in. Or... Dennis Leary, since he's voiced a monotone cat before in the form of Diego from Ice Age. Then there's also Vic, voiced by Samuel Jackson, which, while solid enough, I would have preferred Vic being voiced by Bill Murray. Think about it. Since Vic is more go with the flow and is Garfield's father, it would make a good meta joke in contrast with Garfield, especially since Bill Murray did a great job with Garfield in the live action movie. Overall, it's a solid movie you can watch at any time. It's not the worst movie I've seen, and it certainly didn't make me lose my faith in humanity, as some people make it out to be. As that kind of exaggeration makes you look like you haven't been watching enough movies. I will give this movie an 8 out of 10 with the ribbon of awesomeness. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to make a lasagna.